The red team is dedicated to Bravo Company, 2nd of the 7th Cavalry. Uh, after the battle involving Charlie Company, 1st of the 7th, Hal Moore moved Bravo Company to that position, and on the morning of the third day, the Vietnamese general attacked Bravo Company's position, thinking that it was still occupied by the weakened Charlie Company. Bravo Company was prepared, and they managed to repel a three-hour enemy assault, killing over 200 enemy soldiers while receiving only six wounded casualties. So for outstanding team unity and courage in the service of the Vietnamese team. I don't mind telling you this is a very difficult decision. Uh, we did win, but it's, not, it's nothing to do with me. It's all you people out here, and that makes it a very difficult decision for a general to make. It's the hardest thing I have to do in like a three-month process to get ready for this game. It came down to two separate teams, and we just had to pick one. And I'm sorry, I cannot pick an individual team. It has to go absolutely to the 518th. Can I get a representative up here, please? Nate, call Nate. Let's go, Nate. Oh, they're all coming up. That's lovely. <laughs> There's only like 80 of them. Congratulations, you guys. Way to go, Nate. Keep going through. Keep going through. Except for you. Except for you. You, Nate. <laughs> feedback, feedback, sorry. Congratulations. Quacks is wired. Congratulations. Congratulations, guys. Good job. Congratulations. Way to go. Congratulations. 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 Maybe I should rethink this. Congratulations. Congratulations. Nate. Thank you very much, man. Now, if I could just somehow meld you into the Ursa, then we'd have a war.